Hey guys, this is the follow-up video on the fastest archer in Remnant 2. I was very wrong before, you can really go quick in this game. I'll show you how to reach more than double the normal movement speed in this video. So I'm just going to give a quick example of this build and then I'm going to go over what all exactly is happening. Now first thing, when you load into a world, you want to take this off and put it back on. It's just bugged for some reason, this I don't know exactly why. Something else. Once you know you're somewhat close to enemies, what you're going to want to do is pop your hunter shroud. What that'll do is, uh, that'll allow you to get an extra 15% movement speed whenever you kill an enemy. You can also slide for extra movement speed as well. Here we go. If you know your hunter shroud's about to run out, you can use your relic to get it back. If you want an extra speed boost, just do that and slide again, and then look at that. You're sitting at 87.3 currently. Now, I'm currently 15 down from what I could be, because what you can do is you can actually use the momentum driver ring instead of the ring that lets you fast roll and you can get an extra 15 percent just after sprinting for a second or two all right so we're already here basically at the first dungeon and it's been like i think maybe a minute and a half maybe two minutes but either way let's go over the build first off weightless weight amulet with the Leto Mark II, gives you like a flat 15% bonus and you get all of the armor from this. Don't let this fool you, I have 35.7 because I also have Bark Skin. So, 35% damage reduction, which in uh, in Apocalypse mode actually will save you. You won't get one shot all the time. Normally you'll take two shots to die. So, Leto Mark II with the Weightless Weight. The Deceiver's Bandit lets you get an extra 10% when you slide. This one, um, whenever you have some sort of healing effect going, you get haste, which is a 7% increase to your movement speed. It's glitched, though. It doesn't actually show that. Because if you look at it, movement speed is... Uh, you've got to take this off and put it back on. Movement speed 41.9. And it doesn't actually change to rep represent that. That actually should give you a movement increase. I don't know why it doesn't show it. It could be bugged. Either way, I think this is a really useful ring. Next up is Heart of the Wolf. Straight up just a 10% increase. Next up is going to be this ring right here I use, Bright Steel Ring. What that does is that lets you uh, not fat roll. Because if you don't have it on, you just dive like this. It's super miserable. <clears throat> now, the very last ring that I would substitute this for when I'm just running around the worlds and I'm not fighting a boss is I would actually put on Momentum Driver, which is just after sprinting for two seconds, you don't get stunned, and or you're harder to stun, I should say, and you get 15% uh, extra movement speed, which comes out to, I believe it's 115 after you incorporate your perks here. So this one here, 15% whenever you get a kill, and then this one, when you activate this ability, you get 20%. So let's, uh, let's show a quick maximum I can reach with all of my perks and everything active. I just need to go find an enemy and then I'll show you. Except I can't aim. Now you slide. Activate this ability. And then you're sitting at 87, which that will be 15% higher if you have a momentum driver going. The last thing I don't believe I spoke about is chilled steam. You get an extra 10% from that. If you want to do the double concoction glitch, you can also use dark cider for the extra 6%. All in all, I think you can reach right around 120 to 130% movement speed. All right, guys, one last thing I forgot to mention. Don't forget your traits, which are going to be Swiftness, Untouchable, 
footwork and fitness. All of those are going to help out a lot. The rest of them are optional and your choice. Uh, if you guys like the video, feel free to drop a like, subscribe, and comment. Thank you. Peace.